sorry to break that to you. We can go and pee in the woods later. I'm gonna go step in the goon and hurt myself. Hello and welcome back to this Let's Play of Corpse Party. In the last episode we were looking for... I mean the memoirs really, that's what I always look for. Okay, let's save. Um, so we were looking for the memoirs and realised that we're going to have to play a lot more of this game before we see the memoirs. I think we've already... Yeah, we already did this one. Um, we found somebody else here? Um, I mean, take a look at the last episode. I'm not very good at explaining things, clearly. Um, that wasn't where I thought we were. Oh no, it was. Okay, I'm just dumb. It's okay, I'm dumb. Uh, oh, we've already done that one. We've already done that. Okay, so there's nothing there. What am I supposed to... I'm supposed to be finding someone? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing next. Have I... Is there something I'm supposed to be doing? We met up with someone and they were like, um... If you see anyone else, tell them to go meet in classroom 1A. But like, there is nobody else here. I can't see anybody else. Oh! Yeah. The glass door is now in pieces on the floor around you. Tiny key. Found a tiny key as a golden sheen and very distinctive shape. Regretfully, the nail pulled a broken impact as well. It seems its usefulness has come to an end. Oh, I wonder that's for. What would the, this key be used for? I'm trying to think. What have we seen that would need a tiny key? Is there something in the infirmary? Infirmary. Infirmary. Shall we go back to the infirmary and see? I'm honestly just guessing from now. I'm gonna go with the infirmary. I'm sh assuming you can't. Use a key- oh! Well, no. I was like, oh, I thought it had gone, but it's not. I was saying I assume you can't use a key to- Oh, come on. Oh, it's not for, like, the weird wing, is it? I have a memory that there was something blocked and we couldn't get to it, and I, like, made a comment that it was locked and I couldn't get to it. Oh! It is! Okay, it wasn't what I thought it was then. Uh, tiny key, yes. The door opens to the second wing. Let's go! Oh, now outside. Why don't you just jump the thing? Bro, it's freezing out here. A second wing, huh? Can't believe the school is this big. Oh, are you alright? I'll be fine. She still needs to pee. Maybe there'll be a faculty bathroom in the second wing? Seems like we could climb this fence pretty easily and get out the hell out of here. But look at these woods. It looks like they go on forever. And they're completely surrounding this whole building. So there's like nowhere to go. I guess now's not the time to worry about that. Anyway, first things first, let's take care of Yuki's... Yuki's... Ugh, Yuka's predicament. Yuki's. Come on, let's go. Okay. Here we go. Oh. Well, this place doesn't feel right at all. The air is really thick. Oh, big brother, my head hurts. It feels like it's gonna split open. Mine too. And my ears are ringing. I don't think it's safe to be in here for very long. Do you want to wait back in the main building, Yuka? I definitely get the feeling you'll be safer there. No, please take me with you. Don't leave me by myself. Don't have much choice then. All right, no need to worry, okay? I'll stay right by your side. Okay. And a quick sip because my throat hurts. Yum. That is now cold tea. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna oversave this one. 
over save, overwrite this one. Look this way. Seems like going forever. Boys Lavatory. Any and all students with multiple damage in these facilities will be severely reprimanded. Where are you going? No luck in here either. Mm -hmm. Just pee in the hole! Like, I'm in this weird situation. I would just pee wherever. I'm not sure it really matters. Well, there's stairs. I don't want to go upstairs yet. I want to, like, keep exploring the second wing. Oh, did I? Oh, no, I did save. I was like, that looks interesting. Nothing in there? stuff in the door seems affixed to the wall like a model it can't be opened stuff room fix the model can't be opened fair enough uh, fix the wall music room door is locked that door opened by itself oh door is locked that closed even by itself did that just open Rude. <laughs> Someone's playing some music for us. They're not very good. There's not a soul to be seen anywhere near the piano. Did we disturb them? I'm sorry. I think we just dis disturbed them playing the piano. Okay, there doesn't seem to be much in that of this music room. Okay. Um, interesting. <laughs> They're playing again. It does that say suicide site? Like up in the corner it said like music room suicide site. That's creepy. Okay. Numbers. We like some numbers. Going upstairs then. Oh. There's a decaying cop sitting in the chair. Cody. Karen. Cody. Karen. I want to see you. Nayo Takahashi. Cody. Now, Takahashi withered away from dehydration. Everyone's just so thirsty here. We're just all so thirsty. Mm. Cursed art room. That's always going to be a good sight. Something's going to make me jump out here, jump out here. This seems to be where all the watercolour paints are stored. I wish people would just turn on the lights. What was that? It's just a chair. Oh, I thought there was a person. I see. Oh. Oh my god, I told you something was going to make me jump. <laughs> Big brother. I, oh. I see her. I don't recognise the school uniform, but she looks like a living person at least. We should talk to her. Yeah, we should. No, you should not. Uh, we're students from a school called Kizaragi Academy, and uh, we performed this weird ritual with some of our classmates and lost consciousness. And when we woke up, we found ourselves trapped here. Is it the same for you? I don't think she cares. Her expression isn't changing at all. Something's wrong. The female student is staring intently at the corner of the room, opening and closing her mouth rapidly as if chanting an incantation. Big brother? Yeah, we should leave her. 
I'm leaving her alone. I wish I could see more in here now. <laughs> okay. I'm leaving her alone. We'll come back to her if we need to. <laughs> Who are you? Oh, you're Ms. Soraki? Ms. Soraki? Is that your name? Can you not see Satoshi? Your brother! It's somebody else! Yes, there's lots of other people here we brought here too. Uh, come on, let's follow her. Okay. Um, Heavenly Host Elementary School noticed of school closure. Due to the reputation earned from the repeated tragic incidents and accidents in and around the school, plans for its abol abolition have been finalised. There have been sharp decline in registration attendance since the in initial incidents, indicating to the school board that our time is at an end. We sincerely regret to announce that Heavenly Host Elementary School will be closing its doors for the last time on November the 18th, 1975. It is through my own vice that this disdainful decision has come to pass and for what um, for that i must offer my deepest apologies to all who are affected file to all teacher staff heavily host elementary school principal um hello sorry to approach you out of nowhere like this we're students from a school called kisaragi academy and uh she can't hear you What's wrong? No. no one believes you. Not a word. She's crazy. She okay. Uh, even when we finally meet each other, other liver beings, it's like they've completely lost their minds. I guess it really isn't safe to stay here for very long. There's so many crypt cryptical cryptical things the floor is completely fallen away here leaving the stools inaccessible oh keep going i have no idea how to get back to where we were by the way i'm totally lost uh, earthquake damn it I don't like when it flashes red, it normally means a bad thing. It's okay, it's over. You handled that very well. Hey, can you stand? Ah, helpful. The floorboards seem to have shifted during the last earthquake, plugging up the hole that blocked your way earlier. We keep going up? I'm gonna keep going up. <laughs> keep going up until it tells me not to. Oh, that's body. Based on the size, these appear to be the remains of a senior high school student. Koita. Koita. Child Koita. like you. Yoko. Um, Yoko Fujiwara. A uh, foul note with little sister's remains starved to death one morning. Principal's office, no entry. Okay. I wish there was like a map. I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, it's here, piano. Have we been here before? We have. Okay, so we've gone in like a huge circle. Okay. There's only boys' lavatories here. Why were there any boys? Um, I gotta save again. <laughs> save since we're here. Um, east. Where were where was the other memoirs? Because it was definitely in the. Uh, it was definitely in the 
second room at the bottom of the west wing staircase. Wasn't the west wing this way? Wasn't that where we've just been? At the bottom of the west wing staircase. Oh, hit. Victor's memoirs. Four. Cold. Hurts in my fingers. No strength. Strength. No strength to write on desk. Cannot talk or see, friend. Tendon and leg cut. Bleeding badly. Is that it? Bleeding badly. Female students caught, uh, corpse lies sprawled out on the floor. There are a couple of scraps of paper from a uh, letter set gently resting atop of her, her bony hand. Luck is fickle, but I still have faith in it. That good luck charm? I know it's stupid, but I truly believe it works. So I know I'll see you again, Mal. And if anyone f else finds a letter, please wish her good luck for me. Karaoke. Kimura. Wounded during earthquake. Bled out. Okay, so the last memoir is at the end. Memoir. I said that funny. It's at the end of the chapter. So we still got a while to go, I assume. Cool. Is that it? Not go anywhere else? Okay. Still don't know what I'm looking for. But at least I found that memoir. Um, the music ghost. Let's go have a look. Let's go speak to the mu music ghost. I was like, what have we not done? We've like done a lap of the school. Is it music? No, art ghost. What's the staff room? Is it not here? I thought it was here. Did I go the wrong way? Because that's the only thing we haven't done is like actually interacted with that weird ghost girl. Oh, she's still going. Into the grand scheme of things, are they not but a tiny sample of small, insignificant lives? These chicks who are nested within, never to be seen again, washed away by nothingness. Risen, rising and falling in a constant stream. Oh, I do appreciate Sachiko's kind gesture, but any more will only bring me sadness. Please no more. その場に嘘を無双の波に飲まれて私の体はただ浮き沈みを繰り返す。あらふいかつけば、いうことでリスンとワシーサイン。だけどそれ以上の行いはただ悲しみを満たすだけ。二度と来ない。ですかんぴー
The door doesn't seem like it even has a lock, yet it's not budging the slightest bit. Its entire, its entire surface is littered with protective paper charms. Spiritual confinement, Buddha guardianship, banishment of malice, charm of exorcism, metaphysical barrier. What the hell? Why are all these protective seals in? Is there something inside? Look, you really shouldn't hold it in this long. It's bad for your bladder. Why don't you just go in the corner? Oh. How about outside then, in the woods, along the walkway? Along the walkway. That should be fine, right? Okay. Okay, is that where we're going? I'm actually going to step in the goo first, though. <laughs> Sorry to break that to you. We can go and pee in the woods later. I'm gonna go step in the goo and hurt myself. How far can you get? Oh. The HP is getting low to recover. Turn to a lit candle. How far can you go? <laughs> How far can we go? <laughs> How far can we go? <laughs> Big brother! Wrong end! Because I died! Funny. I thought that was going to last longer then. There was actually going to be something, but no, you just kind of died. Funny. <laughs> five. Come to poison and collapsed. Hold on. Is that a five? Yeah. Oh, wrong end four, because it's four wrong ends, one right end. Four. <laughs> Don't make that joke, dear. That's so stupid. Um. Okay. Go up. I'm gonna go the long way around. Who knows what interesting things might happen when we go the long way around. Is that where the goo is? Yeah. <laughs> Let's not do that again. Okay. Let's go this way. Probably would have been quicker to go the other way. I don't know why I'm going this way. Oh, you know. Funsies. Let's go. Because we're going outside because Yuka needs to pee. Music cream. This way? And yeah, it is this way. Okay, it's all you. I'll be waiting right here. You shouldn't have any trouble getting over the fence, right? I think I can do it. If anything happens, yell really loud and I'll come get you, okay? Okay. Well. It's taller than I thought. Can I really get over it? Let's see. This isn't going to end well. <gasps> Yuka? Oh, there's a spirit. Eek! Don't look at the spirit. It's going to get you. Or should I have looked at the spirit and get another one of the wrong endings? Maybe I should have just let the spirit get me. Oh, I should have done it last time. Oh, well. Big brother? Your brother, where are you? Oh no. No? No! No, your brother! Yuka. Sad. Poor Yuka. Oh, she's just gonna cry because I'm gonna go let the ghost get her. <laughs> Is the ghost still here? Oh no! Hi! Get back! Get back! Ghost! Gotta still give it back! Oh no! <gasps> Where? Please don't be too disturbing. It must be night time. I must have woken up in the middle of the night again. 
Oh, Probably oh, drank too much juice Joe's before fine, bed. Oh, oh. So I'm up anyway. Guess I'll go wake big brother and bug him a little before I go back to sleep. And maybe drink a nice big glass of peach juice too. Yeah, that sounds good. Oh no. Huh? Give it back. Give it back. What? Oh, because I don't have tongues. That's why it sounds funny. Give it back! Ew. They're trying to rip out your tongue. The spirit of the little girl peels right in front of Yuka's face, glowing a bluish white. Where the left eye should be, only a gaping empty socket could be found. Oh, maybe she wants the eye, not the tongue. But look at her, like, tongue. So funny. She's gonna take your eye, she's gonna take your tongue. The distinct snip snip sound grows ever louder as the spirit draws nearer and the presence and presents the item she holds in her hand. It's a pair of sewing scissors, and she's brandishing them dangerously close to Yuka's face. The inner blades are dull, rusted, and caked with blood. There is a there is little doubt that the following events are going to be an imaginarily excruciating. Yuck. Give it back, give it back, my eye. She wants the eye back. The girl repeats her futile demands over and over again, bringing the blades closer and closer and closer each time. I can't move. Big brother? Oh, she's angry. She is an angry one. No, big brother. Yuka's left eye offers little resistance as the jagged, blooded, soaked scissors, or oh, blood-soaked blade, is plunged deep within. Squidgy sounds of disgustingness. Yuck! 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 Her vision runs red as waves of unbearable agony trigger unconscious screams of pr primal, nearly animalistic torment. She instinctively reaches up to pull the scissors out, but just touches them lightly causes her causes new jolts of torture torturous misery to flow through her body that is a hard thing to read out loud the sounds of a foreign object scrape <laughs> the sounds of a foreign object scraping against her cranium echoes through her mind massive mass mercilessly not from her eardrums but directly to her brain yuck Oh, that's so disturbing. Oh, I have this weird phobia. I don't like the thought of bones being touched, like my innards being touched. It really grosses me out. Oh, so the like description just really, I really don't like that. No other experience could possibly have prepared her for this. It's all the suffering, suffering of the world, coalesced into a single moment. <coughs> Yucky. The pain growing ex exponentially worse with each heartbeat. Yeah, the trauma of her experience makes her hurt heartbeat faster, creating an endless cycle. It's not something you can adapt to. It's not something you can ignore. All you can do is thank heaven above when you finally die. And when will that be? More descriptions? Oh, snip snip! Oh! And the tongue? Oh no. <gasps> Wrong end! We got another one! Oh no, I was not expecting that to happen. <laughs> you know. I thought I'd be collecting the memoir wrong ends, but it turns out I'm just collecting the um other ones. Uh Eyes dug out of skull by spirit. I am going to end this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will catch you in the next episode. Bye.